built the makings of a, you know, a final. We're preparing extremely hard to you know, get our best performance and that's what we're looking for on the weekend. I think it's pretty close to be honest, but we're really confident going in this game. You know, we're not going to get caught up into thinking about three times in a row. We're going to a different proposition for this game than we were when you played them earlier in the season. Yeah, early on we were still probably finding our feet. Uh, you know, a number of players had only just come back, and um, you know, I think we were much improved. And particularly in the last couple of months, we've uh, showed some really good signs moving forward as a group. Uh, you know, everyone's working hard for each other, and you know, the likes of Brett Finch and you know, Gareth Hock have uh, you know starting to hit their strides, and so we're in a good place at the moment. So it's just about really just working hard at training and getting the performance that we are capable of. With any game there's pressure and expectation you know the, the bigger the game the the bigger the pressure and expectation that come with it so um, you know in the end uh, you know Warrington have been uh, you know the best at these types of situations the last two years you know the, the Challenge Cup champions two years running and um, you know they'll know what to do you know for us we're going to make sure we get our game right you know on this day because we don't get a chance to come back next week and and change the results so uh, it's important we uh, you know we play our best game and um, we know the type of game Warrington are going to play. They're extremely good, and uh, they've been, you know, top of the ladder all but one or two weeks this year. So um, we're going to have to put in a first-class performance if we want to beat them. It'll be three Challenge Cups in a row. Um, what do you think that'll be like as an achievement? Yeah, obviously you got, they got the eighties when Wigan did it, and no one's really done it since then. And uh, we're, um, like I said, we're still in both cups and. We really want to kick on to have a good, strong finish to this season. Gazok's back and we've got a couple of other players that are recruited and it's, they're, um, they're playing really well at the moment and obviously Sam's in great form. It's just it's going to be a tough ask, but it's going to be a great game. Either team probably deserve to be favourite. Um, they're pretty level pegging and we're, we're happy that we're playing on our home ground. I think that you know helps uh, with atmosphere and you know I think your home crowd helps and lifts you at certain times and, and may even put some pressure on you know, uh, some of the decisions that are made within matches, but, um, you know, it's it's nice to be at home and it's nice that it's a sellout and it's, you know, I think it'll be great if it's an entertaining game that, you know, advertises our game. Uh, you know, we certainly like to play an entertaining style and we'll certainly try to do that as much as we can on, on Saturday. Um, you know, if we don't entertain, we'll, we'll, we'll be sitting in empty stadiums and, you know, televisions won't be turned on. So we've, we've all got to, you know, a responsibility to make sure that we play a certain style that, you know, does bring people along to games and to, um, you know, turn on their, their televisions to watch our sport. To play at Wembley and Old Trafford, it's um, certainly part of the reason why you come across to, to Super League. You know, at the end of my time here in Wigan, no matter how long it is, if, you know, if I don't get a chance to to play at those type of grounds and be in those big games, I'll probably look at it as a, as a failure as come across here. So, um, you know, that's you know that's in the distance at the moment. We've got to get it past Warrington, who, who have been the best side in this competition for two years. So, um, you know, we've got a lot in front of us before that happens. But, you know, certainly it'd be fantastic to play in those big games.